The other category is comprised of three subsectors that share funding in the ratio 2 to 2 to 6. What is the ratio of spending in 2006 compared to 2016 of the third subsector? So, first let's look at this ratio here. We can simplify it by dividing through by 2 to get the ratio 1 to 1 to 3. Now let's use this to try and find out the spending for the third subsector. That's this one here. We see that there are a total of five shares, 1 plus 1 plus 3. And in 2006, we're first looking here, and the other category is 30%. So we know that, that those five shares are equal to 30%. That means one share is equal to 30% divided by 5, which is 6%. So now we can write in the shares for each of these. We know one share is 6%, so 1 is 6. Same there. And we notice we've multiplied by 6 for each of these, so 3 shares is 18. That means in 2006, 18% of the total is due to this third subsector. We'll use that later on. That's our 2006. Similarly, for 2016, we have the same ratio, 1 to 1 to 3, 5 total shares, but in 2016 it's 35%. If we take that 35% and divide it by 5, we'll get what 1 share is worth, which is 7%. Now we can fill in these. We've got 2 lots of 1 shares, they're both 7%, and 3 lots of 1 share, which is 21%. So, for our later calculations we're looking at 18% here, and 21% in 2016. Now let's form the ratio. We've got 2006 spending to 2016 spending. And in 2006, we know it's 18% of the total, which in this case is 491.8 million. In 2016, it's 21% of the total, which is 606.6 .6 million. As a multiplier, 18% is 0.18. So you multiply 0 0.18 by 491.8 million. Similarly for 2016, 0 0.21 times 606.6 .6 million. That gives us on the left hand side 88.524 and 127.386. These are both in millions, but similarly to how we divided through by 2 for the whole ratio here, we can divide through by a million. Now we need to simplify it by dividing through by the smaller number, that's this one. On the left hand side we're left with 1, and this divided by the smaller number is 1.44.